Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Esteemed Gentleman Podcast for Wednesday, February 23rd. I'm your host, Scott Labrie, and joined alongside me, as always, Uncle T-Bag, Tyler Sund. Hello. And all day, Eric DeShane. Hello. How's it going today, guys? Good. Good. All right. Yeah. Good. Tuesday. Monday was a holiday, so... It was a very Monday feeling Tuesday for me at work. It was very, uh, yeah, yeah, especially after the long weekend. Yeah, but otherwise, pretty exhausted. Good. Mm-hmm. A little bit, eh? Got too used to relaxation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We all uh, had a fun Friday night. Mm-hmm. We sure did. Went out, blast. went out to the bar for the well. Tyler, you said you went to the bar for, once for a Christmas party, but I don't think yeah. I've been to the bar since the whole COVID thing, and even for a few months before that. Cause yeah, really, because yeah. ever since right, well, pretty much you lived in Elk Point, we really didn't go. So mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, we haven't, and it was it was a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It was it was good. It was a good time. Yep. Yeah, because the restrictions were or the passports was lifted and. Mm-hmm. So everybody could come out. Those free for all, baby. Yeah, and it was a good, uh, <laughs> a good time was had. It was yeah. mm-hmm. got the jukebox banging. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> had some shots, had some food. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, wings, wings on Friday for the first time in a couple of years. That was nice. Yeah, I should have yeah. got wings. I didn't do that. Mm-hmm. I, I messed yeah. up. I messed up. Mm-hmm. That's messed up. right. Yeah, we had those uh, bacon ranch mm-hmm. wrap. Roll things, oh, so good. Mm-hmm. Or frick by like <laughs> end of the night, <laughs> I was starting to <laughs> fart already, and it was just, <laughs> ooh, it was bad. Oh, uh, poor girl sitting beside me, Zaya. <laughs> Zaya, <laughs> like Zaya, what? I'm sorry for what? She's like, ah, oh. <laughs> time to go. <laughs> time to go. <laughs> time to leave. <laughs> yeah, it was fun though. Mm-hmm. Having everybody hanging out and mm-hmm. then the big photo session at the end. Oh God, mm-hmm. yeah, sure. Jeez. Jeez. Oh, man. It's, yeah, it's it's good it's... pictures though. They were. Yeah. It's probably uh, it's probably a good thing we did that because we don't know how long this is going to last. True. That's true. When's, uh, yeah. when's the next time we're going to be able to do that? Yeah, and it's... how long is this? It's nice now while it's everything's all lax, but give it a few more months yeah. and then hey, look at that, it went back up yeah. again. Well, while our country's still in turmoil, trying to figure out what the fuck's going on and what we're doing. Uh... Yeah. Get yep. shit back under control. So we'll see. Yeah, well, it was a good yeah. time. Good time. Mm-hmm. It was a very good time. I had I had a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and then we had a couple of guests show up at my place later that night. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> who's that guy? Oh, that's that's so and so. I don't like that guy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, see you guys later. Good. Hope I don't ever see you again. <laughs> <laughs> it was so good. Uh, I no idea. I, I was think funny. I was just talking. Well, it was J- Dave and uh, who's Justin? And Justin, oh, yeah, Dave and gosh, Justin. Yeah. I think I was talking, yeah. talking yeah. shit to, to to Dave for the most part. But oh, was yeah. it? Was yeah. it him? Okay, I thought you were saying, talking to Justin. No, about that. no, I don't think so. I see. <laughs> about for randomly, me and Justin were were wearing the same uh, Carhartt hoodie. Oh, that's <laughs> right. <laughs> you like, guys had a little thing. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's what it was. Strange. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Man, the house was just packed. Our house is too damn small for that. <laughs> too damn small. Yeah. It was fun, though. It was a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Watch some jackass. Yeah, piled into board. your living room. Watch ja- the yep. first jackass for a bit. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. Fuck, that was weird watching that movie again. Yeah. How young they were. Oh, oh yeah. and the potato camera they were using. <laughs> right. Ooh. And you watch it now, and it's like epic quality. Compared to then, <laughs> mm-hmm. but well, back yeah. then it was just, it was like voyeuristic almost. Where it was like, yeah, let's get it and fucking do it, right? Fuck, get the thing. shot. Let's go. Yeah, oh, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, do it once. Like I want taken. Yeah, yeah. A lot of the, yeah. oh, what's his name? I can't think of the 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 one wild wild boy there. Always uh, party boy, um, party boy. Yeah, uh, all all his shots like on the streets were like it's canon. I was like, oh yeah, yeah, you have one take. Go and get it done while we we hide behind a corner and film yeah. here, right? So it's all stuff like that. So yeah. Yeah, but it was good. That golf cart in the first one. Oh, <laughs> oh glorious, vicious, 
Glory. That was vicious, yeah. Mm -hmm. On oh, no, him taking a shit in the fucking hardware store. Yeah. Too. <laughs> oh god. Um, but uh, going back to the bar there, uh, Eric Eric left a little earlier than us. Mm -hmm. He went home. Yeah, so I stayed I, responsible so, and yeah, went a bit early. Yeah, no, no, it's all good. Yeah. Uh, but he missed uh, what arguably might have been the funniest part of the whole night. Which was the trip home from the bar. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, Eric, did you hear what happened? At all? I have not, no. So, this is new to me. So, of course, uh, Brett, our friend Brett, was DDing. He had a truck which had six, six spots, including the driver, I guess. So, of course, we're just going to take two, two trips, right, to get everybody back home. Nah. Like a normal person would, yeah. All, for some reason, I blame. I think I'm blaming it on Kent. I think it was his idea. He's like, just get in the box. No. <laughs> oh, three, four of you were in the box. Myself. There was an empty seat Rita, in the yeah, back Zaya, for some reason. Yeah, and Kent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kent had hopped into the back seat, and then uh, I was complaining, and he was like, "Stop being a bitch." And I'm like, "You get back here, then. Stop being a little bitch." So he <laughs> came into the box of the truck. And it was so cold, man. I thought Minus I was gonna die. Thirty-five. You fuckers go in the back of the hey, box. I was trying to say I can wait for the second trip, and everybody was calling me a bitch. And when I'm drinking, you call me a bitch while I'm going to do what you think I'm being a bitch about. So that's just like my trigger word. It's your trigger word, yeah. I ain't no bitch. Sleep or sell, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bitch. <laughs> no, I'm not. But uh -huh. I did not hear that story, and uh, kudos on being dumbasses, I guess. You all survived anyways, but yeah. yeah. We did. We so did. Uh, pretty much like... First turn is like, all right, get off the the main tree as quickly as you can, and then yeah, and then we yep. and then we fucked around with them a little bit. <laughs> yeah, Cause start he, going cause side to side. To. Yeah, yeah, fun stuff. <laughs> yep, grown ass adults doing childish. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like, there's a picture of me too, and I'm just like, I looked so upset and displeased, <laughs> like an old grumpy man. And then from the back of the box. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Guys. What else hap stuff. what else happened? Kent got an earring. Oh yeah, yeah he got his ear re pierced. Oh, Isaiah, that's... yeah. Oh fuck. Isaiah was very like pushy that night. Well I was also like shit talking her too. You were, yeah, you were night, yeah. Getting her all amped up. I guess Kent and uh Zaya were not feeling good the next morning. Ooh. <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah, it wasn't like, good, Kent, I guess. Yeah, Kent go to oh Kent, he's a... He's a uh, bitch. I Kent, mean, are you listening? You're a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Calls me you, a bitch. When you order five drinks at last call and down them all before within an hour, yeah, you're not going to feel the greatest come. I didn't day. even know you could do I, that. I don't not. think you can. I don't think you can. I think legally you can. Well, no, you can. no yeah. I don't think so because nope. I did that uh, when I was at the when I was at the casino like years mm -hmm. ago, and I'm sitting there having drinks, and I'm like, "Can I get like a uh, like a triple?" And they're like, no, we can't offer you more than a double. I'm like, okay, I guess I'll get three doubles then. They're like, uh, okay. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I don't think they're, I think you're not supposed to have more than three ounces at a time. Like, well, yeah, but it was five drinks. Like I think it's so. Five, it was five drinks, but I don't know. I don't know. Who knows? Right? Yeah. I, they were I'm probably like, just what like, the fuck? Whatever. Like, whatever. We have couple oh, customers now, right? We're getting so, these five drinks so we can share it with everybody. Yeah. yeah. Probably, but they could have. Sad, that card, right, right? But, so yeah, yeah, but still, I was like, okay, like whatever. But I just had my one beer, and that was all I wanted. Yeah. And it was good to visit. So I was, all I wanted to do was visit. That was my one thing last night, and it was a lot of fun. It was a good what time. The, what's happening up there? <laughs> Leia is has got some kind of tube, and she's blowing through it through the <laughs> little <laughs> cat hole in Wait. the basement entrance. There. So, <laughs> so Eric, you, you said you only had the one beer. Yep. So who? Who did you give my, that shot to then? Because I bought everybody. A oh, shot. I, oh, sorry, sorry, I had that. Sorry, I had the shot. Oh, you too. Did that. Yeah, okay. I did have the shot. That's right. Yeah, yeah. I had that apple pie, whatever you ordered. There, yeah. I had that too. But that was yeah, really that was weird. Very early in the night. Yeah. Yeah. No, so okay, I stayed responsible, and yeah, I thought yeah. we were gonna get more shots than that, but yeah, I know. Nobody but else. Uh, uh, was feeling generous. Hell of a night. No. No tight budget, man. Apparently, uh, we had a tight budget. <laughs> very much. <laughs> like, hey. We need to do some pre-drink at my place first before we go out tonight. <laughs> yeah. And it, it, like, Not used to it. As, as fun as it was, yeah, it was expensive. Like, six bucks for one ounce of alcohol with 
with watered down mm-hmm. pop, like right. Okay, that's that's quite pricey indeed. So yeah, yeah. it's it's a tough call for sure. Yeah, yeah, and we were talking about that too when we used to go to the clubs in the city all the time. Like mm-hmm. how much of that's actually like really watered down? Oh and yeah, just like all pop and ice and mm. whatever. That's why I, whenever and they're I do charging ask for, for for a drink, I ask without ice because that's volume that's wasted on with water, <laughs> right? So yeah, it's like you no, know, it's give me pop and give me give me alcohol. I don't want to fucking ice in this thing, <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, the the two that were complaining about how uh, oh it probably all watered down, blah blah blah, but then they threw up the next morning. So I don't think it was watered <laughs> down, but <laughs> no, no. a certain amount. There's still a fair bit of alcohol in there too, right? So, yeah. yeah, it's, it's just yeah. the sugar's watered down, and that's yeah, why no. beer is the best bet. You know you're getting beer. Tastes mm. like ass, but whatever. Mm. <laughs> That's why I get clamato. That's oh. lowers it right down. It's so good. Yeah. Disgusting. Should have got a what were the Long Island iced teas? Yeah. Did you? How was that? By the way, Scott. That's good. You ordered that one. Yeah. Yeah. Now yours. Okay. Yours actually tasted tasted quite. I think I just had one really terrible experience. With Long Island iced tea, they put a little too much of something that <laughs> they shouldn't have, and I'm just like, ah, <laughs> this is fucking disgusting. <laughs> I remember ordering it, and you're like, why? Those are gross. They don't taste like iced tea. I'm like, yeah, they do. And then like, get it, and like, here, taste it. It tastes like iced tea. And they're like, that's because they put iced tea in there, <laughs> and, and I'm feeling the buzz. So I like, asked the waitress, did you guys put iced tea in here? It's like, no, it's Pepsi. It's like, I'm like, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Uh, there was a lot of idiot moments that night for oh, me, yeah, for time. sure. That was fun. I taste, I it, yeah, tasted identical to iced tea. I didn't even taste the Pepsi in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that triple sec. Yeah, yeah. That was good. Well, it was fun. Listen to some good music until uh, some everybody good else started, music. Some good music until yeah, everybody that, else started. That jukebox out. was hard to figure out. We we're having a hard time with that all night. We couldn't quite get it to work. Well, it's because like some lady went up there. And like requested like nine George Jones and George Strait songs back yeah. to back to back. Oh, so yeah. like, you, if you wanted to hear your songs, you had to play play with priority, which is like an extra credit or whatever. So it's like yeah. the price of one and a half songs or something like that, just so you can skip, yeah. skip the garbage. Yeah. 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 I'll have to do that again. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Should. Yep. It's fun. Makes you look forward to summertime hanging out and That's what I was thinking. I'm like, ah, can't wait till it's yeah. summer. Especially when it's yep. super cold fucking today. Yes, exactly. It's supposed to get cold again tonight too. Fuck. Mm-hmm. Cold again tonight, but then by a week's time we're at plus one. Yep. Yep, by next week it'll be balmy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. This is kinda of like Crazy. the most like weird winter in like a long time like mm-hmm. with this back and forth stuff mm-hmm. yeah it's usually like always all cold but yeah like it's it's like one temperature consistently yeah. and that's it mm-hmm. it's like either it just... minus 20 and or below or it's minus five or something like there hasn't been like minus yeah. tens and minus 15s or whatever it's all mm-hmm. strange weather's strange no mm-hmm. consistency alberta weather especially is terrible yeah, this is extra weird, though. This is very weird. Yeah. Global warming, pandemics, World War Three. Yeah. Armageddon is coming. <laughs> coming. Yeah. Yep. Four horsemen okay. of the apocalypse. Yep. Yep. As long as we get to watch the the next season of The Boys before that happens, I'm ready to go. <laughs> Priorities, eh, Tyler? Trying to think of what there is to look forward to before the the world ends. <laughs> Is that coming out yep. this year? Must be. I think it is, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I'm trying to think of what else is coming out this year. Obi Wan I watched... Obi. Oh yeah. Obi Wan's yeah, yeah. out in May, yeah. So that's a good one to look forward yeah. to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I watched the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I was so pumped to watch it. Mm-hmm. I watched it. it was uh, very stupid. <laughs> you don't say. I heard. Incredibly I heard. Stupid. I saw like a screenshot. They were like doing like an Instagram live or something like that while somebody's getting yeah. murdered or something. Yeah, the basic story <laughs> is all of these uh, online. Uh, what do you call them? 
personalities personalities i get yeah. yeah and so they bought like this abandoned town and they're trying to refurbish it and they're going to turn it into like a restaurant and something else or whatever but there's like these two that are still living there the original hewitt family that's still alive so like tommy and his mother or so I, I don't know who she is i can't remember it didn't make any sense anyway and then all of these instagram followers and investors show up on this big party bus and yeah, Tommy goes fucking ham with his chainsaw. It was amazing. Like, hey, the gore and the effects was like, this is exactly what I was hoping for, but the, the story and the decisions were actually like, it almost turned the show right off for me how stupid these people oh. were. <laughs> I don't know if that was the intention because it's like all of these, you know, like, uh, it, yeah, influencers. Yeah, influencers. That's, that's the name. Is that what we said? Yeah. Yeah, that's what we said. Yeah, yeah so like, like super offended and all the time and all this mm. stuff too. And he just fucking, <laughs> yeah. So then he comes onto the bus and they're like, Oh, who look at this guy. This guy's whatever. And so they all pull their phones on. They start live streaming it. And he just comes at them with the chainsaw, this whole bus full of people. And like that part was, uh, it made me actually pretty squeamish. It's been a while since I felt squeamish. I was pretty, uh, mm. Ooh, you can tell where all the budget went. The movie is only like 72 minutes from like oh, wow. start to end credits. It's very short. So it was like a quick, like gory crazy action mm -hmm. thing and there were mm. so many stupid parts like this doesn't make any sense you're fucking stupid yeah <laughs> i've been waiting 40 years to find you you killed my friends and then she doesn't even shoot him I'm like why aren't you shooting him <laughs> you have him right there you oh and then she gets ah fuck whatever i'm not talking about this is, so dumb. is the texas chainsaw massacre like a uh, like Mike Myers, where he's got some weird like superpower kind of bullshit. Kind of thing. Yeah, it, it seems like it. Yeah, because he gets shot. I don't know how many times in this one. Still in the dark. original, he gets shot and he gets hit, and like you think he's out, and he keeps mm -hmm. coming back and coming back. It's kind of the same deal. Mm -hmm. But uh, he is actually considerably like he's pretty old in this one, mm -hmm. but he's still got the strength of like thirteen strong men, pretty oh, yeah. much. Yeah, picks up this freaking cowboy like he's nothing. Takes a hammer, freaking oh ah god, there's some good stuff in there. There's good like violence, but like good, yeah, good. You need you need at least one character that you care about in there. At least one, you know, just, like yeah. The only one I cared about was was the was Tommy with the chainsaw, but I don't know if that was the intention or not because it's just like maybe it was. I don't know. It's just it's weird. It's so weird. I felt watching um, AVP two, Alien's Predator two was like I don't give a shit about any of these characters i don't care yeah. who die lives or dies they all are stupid and dumb just yeah end it all right i just want to see the alien and predator fight and they hardly do even do that so. exactly yeah so at least the texas chainsaw massacre gave viewers what they wanted they wanted a good oh. gory slaughter they fest, wanted a massacre gory. by chainsaw and that's and exactly what you get and they really the drove that home it was good it was good mm. yeah yeah that's cool Interesting time to drop a, a yeah movie. Mm -hmm. Valentine's Day, Easter, mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. it's yeah, it's a little strange. I mean, I'm okay with it. I could use horror films. Yeah, that, that's your any time of the day. Yeah, exactly. I'm right? good for that. But yeah, yeah it's just, it is like you said. It's a really strange time to have it. Like whereas like Fear Street, they came out around October, and it was like three horror films. Like oh, that was cool. Mm -hmm. Those movies weren't that great it was either. Thematic but at that point, right? It makes sense for that, right? So yeah, not so much. It was probably weird. Yeah, it's a little weird. But yeah, I also watched "Don't Breathe" Part Two. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How was that? Yeah, it was terrible. Well, you it did one. not yeah. need to happen at mm -hmm. all. It was a completely different tone, completely different everything. It was. I felt that, like the first one looked interesting. And I felt I thought it'd be interesting. To oh, watch. I haven't watched it yet, but first you, one is you, fucking you a thing. masterpiece, yeah. man. And like tension and violence and good acting, good story, realistic stuff happening. Like it was, well, to a certain extent, I guess, but, and the mm -hmm. twist was really good. And then the second one was just like, this is dumb. What are you doing? And then they tried to, what? Does the turkey baster make a return? It does not make a return appearance. No. Uh, no. That's I what killed I don't know if I'm, I'm happy, like, happy or sad by that. <laughs> right? Because <laughs> I did not expect that. When you see that, it's like, oh, this is a whole new ball game, man. <laughs> well, the turkey baster scene. Yeah. I've never seen nothing quite like that before. Yeah. Don't want to ruin it. 
for anybody. Okay, yeah. I, I haven't seen it yet. So I'll oh, if it. you have I not wouldn't... seen, if you've not seen, don't breathe. Watch it. You won't find that, that scene. scene on YouTube. So <laughs> you will. Not. Oh no! no. <laughs> Damn. Definitely won't. It's very good. Hmm. Fucked up. <laughs> yeah. I gagged a little bit. But Nasty. Yeah, it's good. Gross. It's good. It's good. The whole movie itself is really good, though, too. Mm-hmm. It is, it is pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely knew how to keep you in suspense the entire time. Mm-hmm. I saw um, they're making a Weird Al Yankovic biopic. Oh. Oh. And, oh, uh, I think I heard about that. Who's starring in it? Um, Daniel Radcliffe. Oh, good about. call. That's a good call on that. It's interesting. Hmm. I didn't. I didn't think I was like. That's a weird one. I don't know. I don't, <laughs> Maybe because I don't it's know, like I was I like that's just Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah, same. Right? Like I, that's. I know. I I seen Weird Weird Al on like stand up shows, but I don't know him like off of that and how he is elsewhere. Elsewise, so I'm like, I'm, I'm curious to see how that one, why that would be if the case. So yeah. Hmm. yeah you think like. Maybe a Michael Sarah or something like would have fit it. Yeah, more. like a tall, gomery kind of looking yeah. guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, some English dude. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I'm sure that'd be an interesting story to tell. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'd be curious to see that. I think. What other movie news happened? I thought I read something else. Well, there's like I guess like. I don't know what the show... I think it's a TV show or something, actually. But Tom Holland is going to be in a show. And uh, they casted, like, his mom in the show. And, like, in real life, the his mom is, like, 10 years older than Tom Holland is. It's very strange. Jesus. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um. And everybody's like, why would you cast this this lady? Like, she's, like, 35. I forget what her name is, but... And she does not look old at all either. So it's like, it doesn't make any sense. Mm-hmm. Huh. Yeah. So what's the story? Like, do you know what the story is? I have no idea. You Which must is... just have like a young mother or something like that. Maybe she. Maybe. Yeah. Weird. It's weird. Also, uh... it's like, I don't know, like maybe there, maybe it's supposed to be a teenager thing, but I don't know. Tom Holland's kind of getting to the point where he can't be playing teenagers anymore. He's kind of starting he's to look a little, little older. He, I, yeah. I don't know. Like he, you see him in Drake and everyone's telling him, uh, yeah, Uncharted and I'm saying, he still looks 17. I'm like, yeah, I do see. He does look very young still, but yeah, I, I wouldn't say he's like, that, to me, the whole casting of that movie is all wrong. Mm-hmm. But, it's all wrong. Yeah. I'm sure it's an okay, like, it's got okay reviews, like, above yeah. average reviews, but I just... That was this one thing I said right today, too, as well. And Mark Wahlberg, point, fuck off. I made $1.8 million over the weekend. I'm like, oh, it's pretty good. I made $1.8 million over the weekend. But that, well, that's not like, you know, big numbers like it used to be back in the day, but that's still post-pandemic-wise. It's not bad. $1.8? Yeah. $1.8 million over the that's, weekend. That's not good at all. Terrible. Terrible. 108 million, 108. Oh, fuck. That's, Sorry, yeah. that's, oh. that's a wave. Sorry, 108, 108. Yeah. Yeah, 108 million over the weekend. So yeah, yeah, that's, that's not bad. Good. Yeah. yeah, but but it's still, I won't watch it because like, oh yeah, like they're just, I think it's just a cash grab, but like it should be better casting than that, but, but whatever. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, if it's on, if it comes to like Netflix or Amazon eventually, I probably will watch it yeah, just out yeah. of curiosity. I don't think I'd Mm-mm. pay money to go see it, but no. I don't know. I've been surprised before too, though. Like I watched the trailer for Jumanji. Like, man, they got the Rock in here and freaking mm-hmm. the other guy. It's always with them. All the Kevin Hart all Kevin the time. Yeah, he's always with them there. And I'm like, ah, this yeah. is gonna be dumb. Jack Black, like, ugh. And I watched. I'm like, man, this movie is fucking <laughs> awesome. Even the second one was fucking awesome. Yeah. I was like, well, maybe, maybe this one will be the same. Yeah, mm-hmm. hopefully. Maybe it'll be good. Yeah, hopefully. But mm-hmm. just yeah, to me, it's just weird casting because, like, oh, if they want Drake when he was younger, that's so it's cool, but like, there's better choices than Tom Holland. I'm sorry, yeah. but yeah, have like, you guys played? Drake. Yes, I played four. It was a game you played four. four. Have you played the other, like, any of the others? I know the others before. I watched game uh, gameplays of them and watched like the the, the cutscene movies and everything else. Yeah, so, yeah, I've only played four because it came with my, my PS4 when I bought it. A Thief's End or whatever it's called, yes, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. That one was yeah. really fun, really good. That was really good. Who would you get? Yeah. The other three, really uh, sorry. Who would you cast would instead cast? of Tom Holland? I think we all have the same answer. It's going to be Nathan Fillion. Yeah, but well, it's supposed to be a young Drake. 
No, but this is supposed to be young as, as younger Drake. Oh God, uh, Chris Pratt. <laughs> that's all. That's that's current day Drake. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's terrible. Uh, I don't know who I would pick, but I don't know. Not Tom Holland. Uh, I think who 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 would. F- I don't know. I'm not not too not too well versed with newer actors, younger actors. I'm more versed with older ones. Timothée Nicholas Cage. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Nicholas Cage could be Sully. <laughs> yeah. I he probably could oh, <laughs> with good. the mustache. Good, yeah. It'd be a good choice for Sully for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I I'm think. not. I'm not as down on it as you guys. Same. Are, so. Yeah. But just like yeah. Well, oh, like if it like I said, like if it comes on a streaming, I'll. I'll I'll watch it. I'm pretty yeah. sure I will watch it if I see it on there, but I wouldn't go where are the, where are the v- reviews on it? Do you guys look? I have not. Uh, let me see. Um, Rotten oh, Tomatoes. 2022. 40%. That's, 40%. That sounds yeah. about right. Yeah. 90, 90 audience, 40% critics. So it's one of those movies. See, and on IMDb, it's 6.7 out of 10. Overall. Yeah, it's going to be one of those, like, critics hate it, but fans love it kind of movies. And I, ah. Yeah. It just looks like a like a popcorn movie. You know? It does, yeah. It looks like, like... Yeah, sometimes that's all you need, though. Like, that's like Jumanji. But that one, that was a popcorn movie, and it was hilarious. And, it was and fun, good yeah. action, and good story, good characters, like... Mm-hmm. And good performances from everybody. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. Huh? Yeah. I was just, like, weird, like, because I watched... Uh, What's his name? Moist, Moist Critical or whatever. Do a review on it, mm-hmm. and he's like, "Yeah, he's like kind of saying like, oh, I like the the airplane scene from the games better.' It's like, well, yeah, because you saw it in the games first, and it's like an actual active experience in the game. Like, of course you would like that, more. right? Like, mm-hmm. yeah, I don't know. It's a silly thing to say. It's hard to you can't compare. <laughs> yeah, it's like I don't know. No. Yeah. It's like saying, oh, I like the first person sequence in Doom better in the game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> That's in the game. But yeah. I don't know. We'll see. I, I'm sure it's. I'm sure fun it's movie. amazing. No. I don't, I don't Best do movie ever. Better than Indiana Jones. Dude. Crystal Skull. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everything is probably better than that. That's not. That's not. That's not a bad call. Yeah, uh, maybe. Yeah, probably better than that. Uh, yeah, I'll probably watch it when it comes out on somewhere to yep. watch. Disney Plus? No. Uh, Netflix Sony's probably gonna be Netflix or HBO. or Amazon maybe or even Amazon. Yeah, it's, I don't know. Sony. I think Sony's with Netflix. Yeah, they do. I think so yeah. too. Okay. Well, yeah. there you go. Mm-hmm. So I think because I think the rumors is that Spider Man uh, No Way Home is going to be on. One, is it either Amazon or their um, Netflix or HBO? I forget one or the other. It's, it's something. Like that. It won't be on Disney Plus when it first comes out for sure for streaming. Which one? Sorry. Uh, far from No Way Home. Home. No, sorry, No Way Home. Sorry, No Way Home. Mm. Uh, the new mm, that's Spider-Man. weird. Yeah, I think the like, other ones have been like that too, where like they start on Netflix and they have a, a contract go. for a few yeah. months uh, somewhere else. Like I know. Um, Far From Home was on Netflix way before it came on for Disney Plus. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. That should be coming out hopefully soon. Yeah, hopefully. I want to watch that again. Yeah. I might Carly be getting... has not seen that. No way. Oh, yeah, true. Might be getting Crave. It's worth it. Oh, I, I like it. Yeah. Because I think I kind of looked into it. They don't have that like HBO extra anymore. It's uh, just Crave. I think it's just it's Crave. Now. I think it's yeah. just Crave now. For like, I hope so. I hope it's like so. ten or thirteen I, bucks a month or something. Yeah, I, I look here. What because I have to watch Raised by Wolves season two, baby. I want to watch uh, Peacemaker. Apparently, yeah. that's got like amazing reviews. I gotta, now it's all done. I gotta I wanna watch it all now. So, yeah. did you watch Suicide Squad yet, Scott? Not yet. I should do that first. Mm-hmm. Is that on here? Yeah, I think I think that's on here too as well. Now, I think I think I just watched. Yeah, it was on Crave. Out. On Crave, I came out and watched it on Christmas time. It came around then. Yeah, I watched it with my nephew over the holidays. Yeah, I can't wait to watch that one again too. Mm-hmm. That's a great movie. Mm-hmm. Hilarious. Mm-hmm. Hilarious. Hilarious. Well, mm-hmm. any final thoughts before we get out of here? 
Yeah, I'm looking forward to this nice short work week. It'll be fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, three days to go. Mm-hmm. Yep. Already have almost halfway down already, yeah? That's right. And for once, this long weekend did not feel like it flew by fast. I will say that too as well. It was nice. It was yeah. just right. Yeah. It was just right. Usually I find those weekends, they go by so fast, but luckily nothing was going on too much for me. It was all pretty low key. And I know all at Sunday after going out Saturday night and Sunday night and so Friday and Saturday, Sunday was like, yeah, sleep day. I'm sleeping all fucking day. Right. And just uh, slept. And then Monday was a nice little break too. And yeah, so. Uh, yeah. yeah. For once, it didn't feel like it flew by and felt cheated. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That means this coming weekend will be like... Oh, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Guaranteed. Guarantee. Guarantee it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, let's get out of here. Mm-hmm. Uh, thank you so much for watching on YouTube. Like and subscribe. That would help us out. And if you're uh, listening on podcast service, give us a rating. Subscribe to that feed. And head over to our Facebook page. Like the page. Ask a question. Submit a topic. Let us know what's going on in your life. Uh, when's the end of the month? This is not next Monday. Uh, two weeks from now. Yeah. Two two weeks. Ask us a One week. Us anything Monday? No, yeah. two weeks. Two weeks at the seventh. Yeah, it'd be the first. Our first you Monday. You right. You right. You mm-hmm. right. I should never doubt. Mr. your questions. You want to hear from us? <laughs> you doubt me, boy. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, have a great Wednesday, and we'll see you on Friday. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Cheers.